A total shoulder replacement is a surgical procedure to replace your shoulder joint. Your main shoulder joint is made up of two bones, the top or head of your upper arm bone, called the humerus, and part of your shoulder blade, or scapula, called the glenoid. It's called a ball and socket joint because the ball-like head of your humerus fits into the cup-like socket of the glenoid. A total shoulder replacement is often done to ease pain from shoulder conditions, such as arthritis, or severe bone fractures. Your joint will be replaced with an artificial joint called a prosthesis. It has two parts that look like the bones of the shoulder joint, a ball with a stem and a socket. A total shoulder replacement will begin with an incision over your shoulder joint. After reaching your shoulder joint, your surgeon will remove the damaged head of your humerus. Then, a hole will be made inside your humerus. Next, the socket of the glenoid will be reshaped. Then, holes will be drilled for the socket part of the prosthesis. Your surgeon will place the socket part of the prosthesis into this area, and the ball part of the prosthesis will be placed into the hole in the humerus. Finally, your surgeon will slide the ball of the prosthesis into the new socket. At the end of the procedure, the incision will be closed with staples or stitches. After the procedure, you will need to wear a sling on your arm for a few weeks while your shoulder heals. For more information about a total shoulder replacement, talk to your healthcare provider.